Alright, so we've seen on YouTube some other types of way to make popcorn and everybody seems to think that, that I live with the kids always seem to love my popcorn so I'm going to show you how I make my popcorn and it's pretty simple if you look in here all I got is about three quarters cup of popcorn and just right around three tablespoons of canola oil I use canola oil because it can take lots of heat oh, popcorn starting to pop it's all heated up so we're just going to kind of let it sit here and let it pop for a little bit give it a little shake every once in a while try and get those I give it a shake just because in my mind it gets all the kernels that haven't popped back down to the bottom because when the kernels pop kind of catches them and holds them in there and you'll notice you always end up with a whole bunch of kernels in the bottom of the popcorn Once this starts coming off, I'll reduce the heat, get rid of the heat. You don't want to let it sit in there too long or it will burn the back of it. Now, that's pretty simple, as you can tell. I think the trick in, the whole key to it is putting the butter on. So I got probably maybe two tablespoons. You, plus or minus, you use whatever much you want. I don't like to use too much. You gotta have a little bit there. So, let the butter melt down into a corner. Now, I don't use margarine, I use real butter. And this is my key. And I specially had this bowl made so it would spin like that. And pour a little bit of butter on. Not all of it, just a little bit. Salt. Shake. Sample. More butter. We'll get it one more shot of butter. So basically I use probably maybe a tablespoon and a half of butter. The less the better. Hands out of there. A little, more, a little bit more salt, more shake, evenly distribute all. Now let's see, kids, how is it? <laughs> Good. And that's it. Absolutely perfect popcorn.